And we are live with the... And Whoa, oh my god. Okay, sorry about that, everybody. We are outside of Deep Castle right now, enjoying the sights and sounds of uh, some eastern... Um, whatever they're called. Hang on, I gotta do some audio stuff, because that is a very loud train. And uh, I would like to be able to hear myself talk. I don't know if you guys would, but I would. So let's uh, let's recap um, just like kind of what's uh, been going on lately as we watch this uh, fairly Hall and Empties. Um, so I was just uh, on a slight little vacation, not a huge one, um, off in Burlington, Vermont, and uh, to see the Burlington Jazz Festival. That was really cool. Uh, got to hang out with some friends, enjoyed my time up there. And, uh, yeah, pretty much, um, just, uh, did that. Then I went back, uh, home to see my grandma, and, uh, she was doing good. Um, and yeah. So, uh, yeah, I haven't streamed Transport Fever 2 in a while. I've been pretty focused on, uh, uh, you know, New Vegas and, like, um, helping friends out with other streams, but I'm at 45 uh, followers, almost at affiliate. So uh, if you like what you see, if you like uh, train-related games or like westerns, RPGs, that sort of business, you will probably like my channel and uh, you should give me a follow. But um, yeah, so we're actually not going to be doing much in this area because on the uh, yonder checklist, if we go down to where is that stupid thing is? North Haven Coal and Gas and North Haven Hamden Commuter. Ooh, interesting. So today, we're actually going to be starting the one of the last railroads we'll be building on this route. Um, and we're, no, we're nowhere near done either, so uh, don't, don't you worry. There will still be plenty of trains. We're going, I think we're gonna bring this to the year 2040. So that's uh, how many more episodes? Uh, 140 more episodes of this map, and then, oh, look at this, underpass. Oh, Lord, that's good. I like that, we like an underpass. We stand the underpasses. And we got a nice little bower running on by with some oil. How are you doing? You got 46 out of 63, you're half full. Good job, good job, you are doing good. But the reason why we need to connect coal and gas is because, you guessed it, this is not doing enough. Uh, North Haven Heating Gas and Sons, and this is going to be North Haven Heating Coal and Daughters. They're, uh, they love each other very much. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, so we, we basically, we're supplying like a million towns just out of this one thing, so we really do need to boost our uh, supply, and I think the best way to do that would be to take a train, just run it right up. And we can also have a spot where we can grab wheat and bring that to food, and then food to food, and then food to food, and then food to f No, that already has food. Okay, so let's start with the coal. I'm gonna do passengers last, because freight is always most complicated. Whoa! Small stations for branch lines and narrow gauge from 1900. That is adorable. Quite. Okay, but we're going to use uh, not that. We're going to use a... What in the goddamn... Oh, this is the, uh, the extended freight station. So, slightly more modular than your, than your average freight station, which I like. Concrete. Can we do gravel? There's so many wonderful things about the gravel. And uh, yeah, so we're actually gonna need two tracks for reasons you'll see later. We'll do, well actually, now that I know this exists, we're gonna do a 480 meter station. Yeah. Why, I hear you asking? Because we need to also get coal over to the steel mill and I actually think I'm gonna back out of that and we're just gonna do 360 meters because we're already kind of on a perilous perch. And perilous perches are no good. So, first we're gonna make the most narrow curve possible. Gonna have you 
flatten out. Go like so. Right there. And, uh, okay, where are we going? We're going over there. So we're going to have you come up along this way. And it will be here. First, let's just make this bridge. Let's see what we got. Anything new? Anything exciting? We got these that have, like, the remarkably uninteresting pillars. But this looks good. This looks uh, interesting enough. Okay, so there's that. Donezo. So now I think this should be about 360 meters. So what we'll do is we'll branch off here. Once autosave decides to let us go. And then we curve her down. Keep her going down. Okay, it's got to come down just a touch more. Tunnel it. Nope, can't tunnel it under? Really? Well, but what if we do this? What if we take this away? And we yoink it. Is it like the yoink? I can't tell. Because we still have to get it over... Where? Over there. So we actually don't want it to be at that angle. We want it to kind of come around like yonder so do one of those. Big tunnel. Well, I remember where this is going? Probably not, but we'll worry about that later. So now... Ay, 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 ay. Uh, I actually think these lines might end up being independent from each other after all. Then we'll go across there with a nice... Now. Now. Ew. Let's do that. Or what about this? Ew. Okay. There we go. Yeah, so I, um, I apologize for being away for so long to all my lovely viewers. Um, but we are back. Uh, Fallout New Vegas is coming out tomorrow as planned. So you have that to look forward to. Yeah, see, there's a ton of oil waiting here, but not quite enough, so that's why we're doing this. What happens if we... Oh, that's a mighty bridge there, friendo. Are you sure you want to do that for how much? 11 million? Yeah, let's do it. It's the Disney coaster. What do you want from me? Oh, I'm sure everyone missed this uh, incredibly uh, intuitive humor. Okay, and then because coal trains are ridiculous, we're going to put the switch back here. And boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. And boom, boom. Boom. And then cross over here. Okay, so we'll see how this works once we add that second line in there, but Right now, I'm guessing we'll be okay. Yeah, that should work. Anyway. You need to... Oh, uh, no, we're not... We stick to one task. Just do the one thing, and then do the, the other stuff later. Just do it as, uh, as you see fit, right? Oh, yeah, we got this thing, this silly little number. But um, we have a few new mods, actually. Uh, one of them being... Where are you? Give me steam. Give it to me now! 
Did we already pass the point? Oh no, we got these little, these dinky little four, four, oh, four, four O's, O oh, four O's, um, or O oh, two O's if you, uh, if you say it wrong. <laughs> but, um, okay, we got the Sierra. I thought I, um, I thought I installed a logging number, a logging 260. A lot of, t or 262 actually, a Baldwin. But unfortunately, a lot of mod makers don't put enough information, so I don't know when we're gonna know about that. But anyway, so, uh, yeah, the, the era of the 440 is steadily passing us by as the days go on. So, uh, welcome uh, the force of the what is this, a 460? Uh, yes, and new gondola cars. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. How are we doing? Medium? Okay, I don't think there's anything more than a medium grade, so we should be able to actually do something more like that. And then... Caboose. Do three of them. And we'll check the roster. Yay! 46. Where are we at with 46? So I see a 30. See a... No, that's 28. Okay, 46, 35. 46, 37. Any others? Nope. Welcome to the world. For East to wait, no. Why are they green? No, these are these are not green. This is the the North Haven, in which we paint it. Uh, North Haven Railroad number forty six. Oh God, thirty eight. A rose red color. North Haven Railroad number forty six, thirty nine. And North Haven Railroad number forty six, forty already. Uh, new line, please, and we're going to go boop and bang, and it does it automatically, and here we are. So, it's going to be North Haven Railroad, coal, right? Is that how we do it? Coal, gas works. Oh, that really shows how long it's been. Oh, you know what? I'm just realizing this is supposed to be the color of all the South Haven trains, and I accidentally flipped them. So, guess what, fellas? You get to be... red. Nice. Or, you know what? Let's do... let's do gray. Silver. Silver fox. Silver... silver, uh... Silver mammoth, silver elephant, silver... Let's take a ride. Why don't we? Oh, did I pause the date? I don't think I did. <laughs> Whoopee. Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. So he's just gonna pull out. Um, and of course, we already have 66 coal waiting. And he's gonna pick it up. We got 66. Look at that. Oh. Damn. Not half full, but, you know. 75 out of 240. Not bad for a first run. For those who might have forgotten, um, this is the River Delta map. And the River Delta map it was a Transport Fever 1 map that I then converted into a Transport Fever 2 map in order to play because this is my favorite map. I just love all the, the layouts you can make and specifically the, the separate regions. This was really one of the first where um, I just kind of uh, did something like this. So yeah, already we're seeing problems on this hill, but that's all right. Because these 460s have been uh, put out in 1900, and with a 25-year lifespan, the next thing that's probably going to replace them is the uh, UP9000, the 412-2 class. So um, yeah, I'd say we're doing all right. And then after, after the 
9,000 most likely diesels are going to come in because 25 years after, what is it, 1925 is 1950. So there has to be a real damn good steam engine that can do a short haul like this in order to um, warrant the continued use of steam past a certain point. But then in the 60s, things are gonna get funky because all of these are based on sort of like pseudo, like fictional Connecticut and New England railroads. So what's gonna happen when Penn Central comes along? Well, I don't know yet. Uh, I need to decide which um, railroads represent which one. And we'll do that once we get like railroad specific stuff. I think the South Haven is probably gonna be our like uh, New Haven, East Haven Railroad's gonna be our Pennsylvania. Uh, West Haven is going to be like our Chesapeake and Ohio sort of deal. I don't know, because I want to get like, when we get to like this era and the time we live now, our big five uh, conglomerates, which we already have, but they're just named differently. But just like change around the map, change around the rules. I don't know, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just mess around with it, see what goes. It's a nice flat coal route. Could almost put a town out here. Oh, don't even get me started talking to myself. Just pop it on the Discord in case anybody decides to come on. No idea what the audio sounds like, so I'm actually going to mute my mic real fast and uh, and do a test, test, test. And it works. Who would have thought? That is a ridiculous bridge. How does that not cost more than the one across the um, the river? Oh, slowing down. This must be some sort of high grade. We don't have to worry about this for too long, because, like, there's only three trains, and, like, they're drag freights, which mean they're, like, meant to go slow, so... I'm not too worried, because they're going to be bringing more coal than is reasonably necessary to that gas works, and that gas works is going to start spitting out fuel at a rate that's more reasonable than necessary. Reasonable than necessary? All right. Oh, 28. Ah, oh, yikes. Come on. Don't tell me we need to double head. Twenty-five. Oh no, come on. This isn't even a fully loaded train. Oh lord, this is really bad. I should have checked the, the um, high grade because I thought this was all flat. It's never flat. Well, ride's over. Uh, let's check and see, because if they're all waiting for each other, that's not good. And this one is almost exactly half full coming out of the gate. And you're half empty. No, you're half full. Okay, so what are you what are you doing? You're you got East Haven. Havenland has like nothing. What are you? You're you're a Lockwin. So, this, yeah, this guy is not producing enough. And it's because the oil isn't f a flowing in like it should. And the oil is all coming from over here and starving out this one. Not, not too badly, though, actually. There's a lot of traffic over here, so... You have... 403. But each train is running almost full. The 
and there's all this coming in. Yeah, there's like too much oil coming in and not enough coming out. Tis a slight problem. But I also don't want to clog the deep castle route. Well, no, it, it does like this like side chain business and then it comes through this tunnel, right? And then it goes up here. Up a hill. A really steep hill at that. Ooh, yikers. Well, we have the 460, so might as well. What are, what, what line is it? Find North Haven. Okay. Okay, you can go 80, and you have ridiculous power. You can go 75, and you have decent power. I think... Oh man, we could do this. Single command unit, that doesn't, I don't know what that is. I don't know what. I didn't think that was a thing with Steam that you could do. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Let's do 17, 30. 16, 32, 15, 33. Okay, that was what the engine that was already on there was doing at that time. I'll put two of you on there. I'll put three, or should we just do four? Ugh, just have it be an even eight. Let's do four, and if it gets messed up, we'll deal with it. Okay, so that was 46. These are two six O's. We're gonna name them 26 something. 4626. Okay. Name. That's not. Okay. Uh, 4426. 2626. 2625. We have to have like about 40 of these now, right? Like. No. I guess our maximum is 26 then. Right? Am I wrong? No. Wow, we only have uh, 26. Nope. 26, 27. Haha. -ha. So this is. Uh, you said we're number 26, 28. run completely empty the first route. Let's take a look at these. I haven't seen these in a while. It's 1900, so it's more acceptable to use like something that's a little more powerful. It's mind-boggling to me that they made this engine before this point, because it's such a little bitty thing, you know? Oh, and it has a god-awful whistle, but that's okay. We still love it. Ooh, look at all this action over the bridge. Pulling out, you're coming in with 70 out of 70 oil. Oh, and then there's all this business over here. How's the steel mill doing? It is cranking like a crankman. Holy moly. This is probably the most successful industry we have. Then all Dell is expanding inward. That is so cool. That's beautiful. Wow. We already have 364 coal waiting, which completely outmatches what we've put on here now. Right? Hang on. Coal and gas works. No, these can hold 720, so we should be good, actually. A nice little balance. A nice little balance beam. A little balanceman. Oh, you know what we can do? We can have... Uh, but I don't want to run more coal trains up this ridiculous hill, so we'll have this divert off here. Come by. Then, bang. Right? Or no, because we're bringing that coal from over here, over here. So I got a uh, reasonably uh, decent Facebook message. So I'm, I'm going to 
have to find a thing to do while I answer it real quick. Let's see. What is there to do? What were we gonna do? Hang on. What's the? Let's um. Let's ride a train. Why don't we? What are you? You're a Adams Radial with two passengers on board, probably heading the other direction. So we're gonna ride on board here, and I will be back. And we return to the bumpiest track in history that we are now going to fix. Thank you for being patient with me uh, as we fix this nonsense. Auto save, come on. You're shitty. No, I'm just kidding. Please save my game. Okay. That's less bumpy. We're gonna bridge this. Because. Oh, the page up keys don't work. Okay, let's do, instead of going straight down like you want to, please go, yes, keep the electric tracks, we're doing medium street, why don't you go straight, or down like that. How does that look? No, that's awful, don't do that. Why, why would anybody want that? Delete this. Bang. Then we need to delete you, delete you, and then curve Rooney and bang. Now that's fine. But I promise you guys a train ride, so I am a man of my word. We're getting a we're getting a little getting a little train. We're getting a little ride. Getting a little uh, trainman. On board the Adams Radial 4205. Sorry, uh, just answering uh, yet another message. This time from, uh... actually, I'm not gonna say who it is, but, um, because it's none of your fucking business. Wow, you know, taking a few days off really puts you right back where you started. Um, well, that's okay. Um, I just want to kind of use this time to enjoy. Uh, play with some fucking trains, and that's uh, what I'm gonna do. Sorry, I missed Train Tuesday. I know I like kind of like three of my scheduled streams just kind of fell off the uh, hook or whatever it is. Oh, we get to wait for an oil train. Exciting. Oh no, now he's waiting. No, no, not now. Come on, I was enjoying the train ride. Okay, there he goes. Passing another uh, Adam's radial right now, or he's passing us. What do we got? 4204, it's our twin. What is going on over here? Is it the new trains that are messing everything up? No, there's a passenger train ahead of us. This guy's going that way. 
So that block isn't clear, so now he's gonna go and then we'll wait. Yeah, we can be patient, we can wait. Right? Oh, that signal block is like way too close to... It's like we got a little queuing area going. Oh well, we can rail fan from here until our our trusty 4205 comes around. What are you? You're 2621. Let's just do some quick uh, maintenance while we're here, because I know we just made some vehicles. So we gotta make sure that maintenance is on high. Yep. Oh, 4207. Rushing by. In a swirl of steam and all that sort of stuff. What happened to those new trains that we made? Oh, because they're doy. Oh boy. Oh my god. We need to make sure that all of these are at, at least normal. No, these are passengers. They're very high. These are ships, so they can rot. These are the new boys, so they get mediocre. Or whatever the fuck. What are you? 2615. Look at all the trains. Look at how exciting this is. East Haven Railroad. This track is definitely going to need to be quad-tracked eventually for freight and passenger, but right now I think we're good because everything's slow. But once we're trying, once like the real discrepancy begins between um, fat, like like passenger and freight, because right now we're kind of using both for both. Does that make sense? Wow, I did not realize I let the maintenance go so much. Look at this, we have a trillion dollars. We don't need a trillion dollars. Give it away, give it away to charity. Then we're good. All right, back on board, friendos. Just stop for a little scenic route or scenic, whatever, whatever you want to call it. It matters not to me. That's a real dangerous road. People might uh, fall in the drink over there. Yeah, this oil line is real busy. With your bowers and your moguls and your uh, executives. That's not a real railroad turn, but... Hey, there's one of the new boys. Coming around the corner. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Oh, yeah. That's not the <laughs> way that song goes. Oh, lordy. Coming into Lockwin. Lockwin halt, because the trains halt here. Just picking up some. Oh wow, the train's full. Lockwin's doing real good. Next is East Haven, just across this little bridge here. This is the uh, PAX Northern, so it's going to West Haven, because that makes sense. I 
I've charted out all the trains I've made in like 1850 now. Just been going back and watching all the episodes, so um, a lot of uh, South Haven stuff is going to get replaced in 1905. But we can still enjoy it for now. Very curious what's going on in East Haven that all these people are trying to get there. Or maybe they're just like, uh, I don't know. Pretty sure this is one of the newer East Havens that goes up, uh, up the hill. Yeah, because I put the, uh, the Virginian Truckee engines on there. Let's see. Ten people got off. No, not many people got on. Maybe 12 people got off and two people got on. I don't know. Oh, noisy engine, noisy steam engine. Four cars, and it looks full, Jesus. East Haven is kind of like the transfer spot, it seems. So that's where you get all your winter white passengers to take the East Haven in. All the railroads are like interconnected that way. It's like uh, through the different territories. That. What's that all the way over there? That's like the grain train, I think, or one of the grain trains. Yeah, that's the, uh, this is one of the Greyhounds, I think. What do we got here? What's this little thing? Oh, that's the circ the train that brings lumber to the circus. I remember. So if we're here, then that must be the Deep Castle logging facility up there. Which means we are headed for Deep Castle. First person, no less. Oh, that's a steep hill. Couldn't even tell you what goes over there. Probably the oil train. Oh, lumpy track. Bad. That's probably everywhere. And of course we're waiting, because there's a million things up ahead, because it's Deep Castle. There's one of the new oilers with the new tank cars. Positive, I put that Baldwin engine in there, but uh, again, it wasn't um, mentioned what exactly uh, year it comes out. A lot of N4U stuff is just from 1850, so who knows? Maybe there were some options that I missed. Despite all the pausing, you know, this train's running full. Okay, so he's gonna go through there, and then we're gonna probably get held up at that signal for some reason. It's a fairly with some law empties coming back from uh, the sawmill. We've just been following this oil train. He's going up, up. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, who's gonna win, Fairly or, uh, or Adam's radial tank? I think the uh, yeah, the Fairly has that in the bag. My lord. Oh well, the mogul's also going straight, so we're just being held up by all the freight trains today. Oh no, he's on the adjacent track. Ooh, but he has the speed, and we have a red light. So nope. Ooh. Accelerate, you can do it. His max speed is like 50 kilometers. Come on. And he has to wait. So we are going to just go straight through. Another oil train, my lord. I suppose there is like eight of them on the line now. Finally, that oil train goes up to where it needs to go. That isn't on the main line anymore. It's on its own path. 
just as we are. We're going right into the city. Oh, look at this slick little railroad crossing. Toot toot, we're gonna run you over. Hey, there's a bus. Is that a car? Oh my god, cars are here. Already. Jesus Christ. It, ha it can't be. It hasn't been long enough. Though so these Adams radial tanks came along like in like the 1890s, so they're probably not going to get replaced until like 1910 or so. Alright, Deep Castle. What's next? I think West Haven, actually. Wow, everyone was coming here, it seems. Yep, West Haven. Oh yeah, there's our little middies going back to back with some oil. I hear another train. I hear some sort of... What's going on? Where? Where? Oh, there. Wow. I missed that. Oopy. wonder where he was going. Well, that's an Adams Radio hauling freight. Probably goods, because that's what I remember putting on there. That was one of the first Adams radials we put on the line. Back in the olden days. Oh wow, we're in West Haven territory, finally. Blue trains. There goes uh, freight and the passengers screaming on through the woods. They're screaming on through the woods. And we're going to the West Haven. There's another East Haven train. Where the fuck is it going? I don't know. Hope you enjoyed my song.
Oh, wow, now we're passing through the West Haven Yard. And the West Haven Locomotive Works. Wonder how many times I'm gonna have to change those. Put like diesels in there eventually or whatever. And we rock in here and thus our journey to West Haven has ended. We'll go down to the end of the station. Just cause. Just check out the bridge and make sure like traffic's going over it. There we go. Thanks, 4205. You're welcome. Oh yeah, and uh not a whole lot of traffic problems on there because I quad tracked it. Hmm. Well let's see. Now no where now the oil's a flowing. It's a, a flowing like uh like the Jesus water or whatever the fuck it's called on uh on the Bible channel or whatever. Um, hmm. Methinks. We need more planks. Right? What? Huh? <laughs> uh. Now, what does North Haven produce? North Haven produces iron, I suppose. Um. Are you getting fuel somehow? Yeah. I don't know how, but, um... Alright, what's on the docket? Uh, North Haven Coal and Gas. Then the North Haven Hamden Commuter. Oh my god, how are we gonna even pull this off? Maybe up through here? Come up, like... Let's see what this does. E push. Platform roof. We have Coors. Patel. Lang. And on. Let's do Coors. Number of tracks. Uh, let's not do that. Let's do... Uh. Uh-oh. That looks standard gauge to me. Right? Yeah. Speed North Haven Stashion. A, a North Haven a Stashion. <laughs> Fuck me. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay, so I guess. Yoink it. Oh, please, come on. There we go. And just straight on down. We need something that can climb for this, for this route. We need a down, a downward facing dog for this one. Can you? Oh. Oh god. Oh god, what happened? Lag. No. Oh. Please close, please. I don't like it. Okay. Thank you very much. Too much slope, apparently. Yeah, I can see that. Is this tunneling yet?
That's not too much slope. You can do that. Okay, so, coming out of Hamden. Well, the question is, do we just want to run one ridiculously long train up here, or a bunch of little, little guys? I would have done narrow gauge for this, but right now our narrow gauge prospects are, like, not that good. Also, what the hell is going on here? This is not what the doctor ordered. This is not what the doctor said. Hey, I'd like to, I'd like to order one of these. <laughs> oh, man. This is run of the mill. I am like this in real life. Don't worry. Well, so the disjointed North Haven Railroad finally makes its uh, appearance in episode 12, I think this is. Yeah, 12. Can you connect there? Then boing. Yeah, we'll just run a bunch of really, really light trains up here. Maybe like five. No, we'll do three. But emphasis on like light as a feather with a powerful engine on the front because this climb is going to be a narcissistic person. That should be enough signals. Let's. We gotta extend it to Court Mesa eventually, but we won't do that quite yet. Buy a vehicle, please. Okay, you... You. Yeah, you. Um... One. Passenger. Capacity of 14. Ugh. Gross. Capacity of 4, even grosser. 11. 11. Six wheeler. Appears to be. These hold 20, but they're too heavy. These hold 14. These hold 14. What's the lighter? 20 tons? 15. I said 15 tons. What do you get? A motherfucking older and a deeper in debt. Okay, actually, we can do. Wow, this thing has actually got so much tractive effort, it can actually haul. haul 84 capacity trains, and you know what? Darshi, Darshi is, and Darshi blows. We did it. The H class, the 262s continue. So 62, please. Um, we have 6200 and 6201. I don't think there are any others. Nope, 6202. This is 03 through 05. This is the North Haven Railroad number 6203. Number 6204. And North Haven number 6205. And please go on very high maintenance. All right, new line. Boom. And a boom. This is going to be the North Haven, and either North Haven Railroad, and Com. For now, we'll change it. Ooh. Let's take a ride. Uh-oh. Hang on. Ah! No. What the fuck? I don't like that. What are these views? Get me out of here. We go in the cab at least? Oh my god. Hang on. Almost got it. Nope. Don't got it. Okay, we can't exactly ride on this one, but um, we can enjoy it. We can appreciate it. 
Does North Haven have a bus? No. The trains are running before the buses. Let's, uh, let's give North Haven a trolley. Why? Just because I want it. What are you doing about it? Oh, man. I crack myself up. Am I funny? Perhaps not. But at least I'm giving it a damn old try. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. At least I'm giving it a damn old try. That's not the phrase, Chris, but... Oh, should we, should we Dusseldorf? No. Oh, and look. The towns are growing. Okay, so we can't put that there, so we'll put it down here. Bottom of the hill, put you there in the residential, whatever this is, right there. Then boom, and then a boom, and then tram depot. Please. Right at the end of the street. Which I'm going to regret when I make the track extension. Oh yeah, big regrets. I can see it already. But we'll just make them and delete them. Because that's how we do. Right, you have a capacity of 11. You have a capacity of 7. 8. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And you are North Haven Tram One. What's the problem? Ah, I see. No, electric, electric tram tracks. Nobody uses steam-powered trams except for me. Okay, then you guys get full maintenance and a nice little light blue color. You guys, on the other hand, are going to be a darker shade of blue, but that's okay. No, why are you going in there? What is happening? Oh my god. Hang on. This is why you do this first? Yeah. What are you, 6th Street? Come in on number 2, please. Anyway, where, where, where were we? Okay, you're purple now, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six, a seven, and an eight. What? There were nine on the other one. Huh? Okay. Ah. North Haven Tram 2. Did I miss one? Ow. No. Oh well, call yourselves a nice shade of purple. Very high maintenance. Now you'll never die. You are free to live here for as long as I permit. Okay. Well, I knew the coal was gonna work. And uh, yeah, now we have three guys running, and but this guy is not running. This guy is doing not good. Where's the North Haven fuel train? That's Hamden. So I think we need to duplicate all of you and put your maintenance on high. And then you guys, what are you doing? Oh, there's only two. Holy moly. Six. Very high. Speed it up. Trains are doing great. Well, North Haven is now connected to the network, which means we can bring this iron ore down to this steel mill, right? I know that one's closer, but we have these. We have three and three. Got to keep it even. Um, and this one's going to double up, and we already did that with the uh, with the steel, and that's going to be how that goes. And then there's all these iron ores. So what, what are you doing? No, you're going up there. We're not even thinking about that yet. I kind of want to do something interesting here. Let's uh, let's edit, and then we'll add steam. How fast can you go? Not fast enough, unfortunately. 
How about do that? I'll do that. I'll do that. Then force reverse. Force reverse. Force reverse. Modify. Let's see if it works. It does. What is that chugging? Oh, you, you're coming in. We shall see. If it flips, then it doesn't work. But if it just starts doing something else, well, you'll know what it'll do. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted it to do. So, here's something I bet nobody knew about this game, except for a select few. This trains can go backwards. Who would have thought? So now, they have an engine on both ends. They can navigate the hills like bosses. Who's driving cars in this town? And if you are, I demand to know why. No, no one is. Okay, now the big, big picture. Since we did the other two things, we're gonna have this just be a little short, two hours, just to get back into the, uh, into the, um, little swinger, swingeroo of things. I'm gonna cook some beanies for dinner and eat them all up. I don't know if that's, like, a, another word for anything, so if I just horribly offended somebody, I apologize. We are going to connect Hamden with Springwell, as intended in the gospel. So, there is one free track remaining, and it is track four, which is a freight track, so we actually can't use that. Oops. Okay. Um, so, let's do this one. Down, please. Sharp down. I don't know how the Adams radials like hills, but I can imagine it's not very much. Ooh, yes. Okay, but let's do this type of bridge. Bring you around town. Oh, do we have to do a crossover and or a tunnel? Perhaps, yeah. So, let's do one of you. And sharp up. Sharp ups. And then, oh, come on. Oh no, that is not exactly what I wanted to do. Though it does kind of look cool. Question mark. I don't know which of the, these railroads are going to decide to electrify their talent, but, um. Oh, you know what? I'm on the wrong side. We don't need to refund it. What are we? Millionaires? You just come right across. Did that work? No. No. No, no, you will die. Star Wars reference for anyone who uh, enjoys the medium. Boy, that's a little hairy, friendo. It's a little hairy, Harry. Can we just do this? Oh my god, we can. So... The East Haven Railroad's passenger line, their main line, is basically a super roundabout way to get to Springwell. Which, um, if, if anyone is curious, yes, eventually Amtrak will see a, uh, an emergence here, and it will drastically change the, uh, the landscape in terms of passenger. And I'm gonna do, like, Penn Central and Conrail and you know, 
Burlington Northern Santa Fe. Basically what that's going to be is everything north of wherever is going to become uh, Burlington Northern. And then, like, I'm going to do, like, maybe West Haven should become, like, Santa Fe, and, like, the North East Haven Railroad should become Burlington Northern or something, and then Winter Way can be, like, the Chesapeake in Ohio and become CSX and all that jazz. So, anyway, Pax Northern, please. Okay, East Haven, Lachlan Halt can no longer get to Springfield because, or no, Springfield can't get to Hamden because Springfield is coming out of this track, which is now going here which is now coming back to Hampton. And it does it right the first time. Look at that. Beautiful. Now you. Now you. North Haven. Well, they're just starting, so they have to, they have to share. The thing is, is, these mountain climbers will be able to work at high speed, then what am I doing with these signals? Jesus lord. Okay. We do need some more over here, because we're going to have a bunch of trains. And anyway, we're actually going to get rid of this. Oh, autosave. You silly goose. You silly banana. You silly... Okay. Come, why don't you come in? No. Stop. No, stop. There you go. Crossover. Boom. And boom, boom. Let's see how the lines look. Wait a second, what the fuck? Food. Why? What? No. No, 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 no. Mary Cliff Food Factory. Where is that? That's here. Please just go the way you were going before. Did that fix it? Not really? No, I guess it made it more direct, I suppose. Oh, yeah, because it was going all the way around this way before. Wow, okay, we actually just fixed a serious routing problem while doing that. Not too bad. Okay, we're actually gonna have you come out like that. Double slip here, make sure this doesn't break anything. Yes, so now, Put a signal there, so the West Haven trains know to stop. Then we also put... So this signal will protect that. Okay, so I did it right. Anyway, North Haven, and a commuter. Please continue on from Hamden to Springwell. Hooray! But you're not going to go in there because I messed up, so you're going to go over to this track. Spring well track too. Nice. And no longer are you that. You're the in in one fell swoop. North Haven Railroad. Pax Main. Springwell's about to get a lot of business. Oh yes. Um hmm. Should we 
Had more trains. Because how many, how many do we have on the PAX Northern? We have that many. Woofer. That is quite a lot. But now this new stop will actually kind of warrant the, uh, the rapid, um, what do we got here? 4204, right? Yeah. Look at that. There he goes. Half full. Springwell is currently not accepting any machines for some reason. My question is, why? How about for, for you? What do you got? Deep Castle, West Haven, West Haven, West Haven, Mountain Circle, West Haven, Winterway, Plains Village. Or you, Lumber Hub, Shoreport, Aldale. NSB, what's that? North Stony Baloney. Ah, ha ha, ha ha ha, okay. It's time that we did this. More hub expansion. Always a fun old fun time, isn't it? A great part, isn't it? I will, uh recommends the per the first person who understands that reference to uh, follow. Okay, so you should just be able to go from the boom house to the fat house. Yeah. Alright. West Haven Railroad Spring uh, the Mash Springwell. West Haven Locomotive Works. Let's let's have a nice old, a nice old, nice old, and we'll put a bunch of blooming onions on there. So you need uh, let's change the colors a bit. We get two of these, one of these, one of one of these, one of those, and then we'll get a couple of two threes, and then we'll get a couple of. One, two, and then a cruise. Oh. Hey, Killboy Case, thank you for the raid. Much appreciated. Welcome, everybody, to Transport Fever, where I faff around with trains for a couple hours. I'm always a fan of raids, it has to be said. Currently, we are just connecting a town with a much needed supply of trains, or goddammit, machines. Um, and I'm just uh, numbering all my trains because I like being a, a stats nerd. 4641. Then uh, you go on West Haven Railroad. No, I want MASH. There we go. Ra raids are fun. Wow, there's a lot of there's a lot of people here. A whole total of six people, which is more viewers than I usually get. Actually, let's just because we got the raid, let's watch the uh, the the magical four six zero ten wheeler work its way out of the. Actually, let's we could get a better view than this. Come on, Chris, what are you doing? You're the rail fan here. Look at it. Just fucking look at it. It's beautiful. And we're just, um, we're gonna make, I'm gonna make like three of them, all different colors and stuff, so it's gonna be nice little, uh, yeah, I don't know, I like, I like it when there's like some variety, you know. But yeah, seriously, thank you for the raid, it is, um, really good, because I, I was away for, um, the past couple of days I was uh, visiting my grandma in um, I won't say where because it's the internet but um, it, it was fun she's doing good and um, get one of you this is
I can't believe it's 1900 and we already have 42 460s running around this place. Alright, what are you? You're mashed south west or whatever the hell SW stands for. Uh, let's do something different for this one. Let's pause real quick. And then we'll go in here. What's a good what's a good train? What do you guys what do you guys think? I, I will pick whichever one you select. So long as it's a good selection. And it's not this one because this one's a passenger engine. But every, and pretty much every other one is good. And sorta of not this one either. But uh <laughs> You can tell I'm a uh, real, uh, real picky, picky old person. Just refreshing the chat just to make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, yeah, we still have six. I always get, uh, yeah, let's just do this one because nobody replied fast enough. Let's do, uh, yeah, blue, then another shade of blue, and another shade of blue. And another shade of blue. And another shade of blue. Then another shade of blue. Then another shade of blue. And then. Yeah. And boom. No, autosave, come on. The autosave, like, freezes the game in this game, so it's like. You're like, what are you doing? Oh, and I didn't mean to buy two. Go to the scrapyard in the sky. Okay, thank you. And then West Haven Railroad number 4643. And West Haven Railroad 4643 goes on the West Haven Railroad mash, uh, short, whatever the hell it is. Um, yeah, so I, I decorated this part. This is the, uh, the West Haven locomotive and rail car works where they, uh, where they make nonsensical items. Oh, whoops. Someone's got to move these. Oopy. And then we need to go to here, and then we got to make sure these don't break down. And then, yeah. Oh, look at that. Two trains slowly but surely appearing. These trains won't be here for another 60 years, but that's okay. Nobody, nobody look at the man behind the curtain. Oh, I feel so energized that people are watching. That's awesome. Look at him go. So, uh, if any of you have heard the ballad of Casey Jones, or heard the story, or that Grateful Dead song, like, the driver in that train! So this was actually the type of train that Casey Jones was driving when he, uh, went, when he ran a red light and slammed into the back of a stalled freight train. It was this exact engine that they modeled here, number 382. And unfortunately, there's no dynamic number system, so every one of these engines that I've numbered with a completely different number system is called uh, uh, 382, despite it not being that. Yeah. They call it a 460 because it has four non-powered wheels that hold up this end, and then it has uh, six wheels connected by the, uh, the linkage, and uh, there's no wheels in... Uh, supporting the back, so it's called a 460, and its uh, general name is called a 10-wheeler. And Casey Jones was a real person, and he is very dead, because in that song that they reference, he did not make it after that train crash. He was driving the Illinois Central Railroad Cannonball, which was uh, one of the few trains in like early 1890, 1900, that could actually go 100 miles per hour. So to imagine trains that look like this, that can go faster than your car, that was a real thing. So that's, um, and right now we're just taking a little joy ride just cause uh, I wanna see if the route works. And it's also nice to have a little scenic trip um, every now and again. We did a couple earlier just on some of the new routes, but uh, yeah. If any of you need train facts in any conversation, or you need to win a bet, or you need to win a poker game, I am your guy. I can provide all of the train facts in every poker game. I can't play poker, though. I have no idea how to play. 
Uh, we'll see you later, Synth... 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 I'm just gonna call you that. But thank you for tuning in. I, uh, I appreciate your patronage to the channel, and uh, I hope to see you again. going to enjoy the uh, the scenic uh, Pinewood Forest as we leave the West Haven sort of uh, outer limits and head over to, I believe this is Mountain Circle coming up, which we're just going to pass through because this is a freight train. Oh, but the red lights are going to hold us up. These old semaphores, up means go, down means uh, no. Something's going by somewhere. Oh, it's the um, it's the twin middies coming out of the tunnel. Their oil train. Yeah, this is uh, what is this? Yeah, Mountain Circle. I was right. I know this map. Aha! Woohoo! Up above us, we have um, our steam-powered buses because. It's 1900 and there's no rules. Next to us coming in is a West Haven Railroad passenger train. West Haven Railroad is blue, East Haven is green, South Haven is like red, North Haven is like this kind of like silver color, and then um, what's the other one? Winterway is a turquoise, or turquoise if you're French. guy's waiting for somebody. I don't know who. I don't know what's going on up ahead. Next to us is a Spanish uh, 260. Probably the plastic or tools train going to the same exact spot. Oh, he had to cross over. That's, that's why there was a wait, because we need to wait for that other train to clear the block. And if another one comes, we'll be waiting too because this is a busy intersection with lots of traffic. But traffic is fun, I hear you saying. And I don't disagree. I love this song. It's just like a little, 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 uh, little tune. Also that, like, I, I don't know what that is. It's like uh, the song's in E flat, and they just have like a fat G major chord. It's like the five of six, just in there. That's a little music joke. Here it comes again. No, nope. Sorry, that was the uh, five minor of one. The composer for this game really likes his, like, shifting modes. It's kind of cool. This song is almost, like, too eerie for this game. It's like, I'm having lots of fun looking at the clouds, and we're riding around, and we're on a train, and then it's just like, ba da 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 Like, whoa, hang on, man. That's, like, a little, uh, a little dark, a little, uh, a little creepy. <laughs> Oh man, it's good to be back. Yeah, look at those clouds. Good job, Urban Games. Also, good job on the trains, too. This is the new one that came with this game. They just added, like, the, uh, the Rogers 460. Also, someone's passing on the, uh, on the right. No, he's not. Good. Yeah. I like how they make all the trains, like you can paint them different colors, because that really, um, really helps. You know what I wish is you could, like, edit the number on the tender here, where they store all the coal, even though I think this engine was a wood burner for most of its life. But I guess it's 1900, I guess they gotta, gotta get with the times, man. We burn coal now. Oh man, our freight train had to hold up that passenger train. Sorry, bud. Gotta wait your turn. We're first. And this is Shadow of the Valley, which I named this town after my favorite song from Fallout New Vegas, because Shadow of the Valley is just such a beautiful, 
beautiful song. And I think the rules are you can play video game music so long as it's not like a song that wasn't already made for the video game, you know what I mean? So I think we're good. There's another one of those red phase that only have that have two headlights that aren't centered. But that's okay. They had to learn over time. The best place for a headlight is in the center of the smoke box. And we're just gonna whip. Oh nope, we're going straight. I thought we were going to the right. Taking that corner at 80 kilometers an hour is probably not a good idea anyway. I use the metric system in this game just because, like, if you switch to Imperial, it also changes the power rating, like, in the the math behind, like, like you know, your tractive effort and your locomotive power. And I don't know how. To, I don't understand it. Besides, that number is bigger. So I just go by metrics. Passing through North Stony Baloney. It's where all the uh, people from Vermont live. And we got our first returner on the machines front. Oh, what a time to be alive in 1900. I could probably do some stuff down in the valley, like make a town or two down there, really expand the West Haven network. Connect it up to the East Haven and the North Haven so there's more, uh, Interplay because right now the only like connector is at the end of their line at Springwell Which is what the SW stood for when I was faffing around trying to figure it out It's also that iron ore. I got to connect that steel mill at some point get the steel up to the hub Actually, I kind of wanted the the steel to go to the other hub Which is probably going to be next episode is when we start building that because I did say it was going to be a 1900s project pass through that useless signal and get stopped at this one because there's another train ahead of us. Then there's just like this jamming like sax tune which may or may not be mini sax I can't really tell. Ooh, a Caledonian, hauling oil. And here we go, here comes our, our triplet, one of our triplets. Sisters, brothers, who, who gives it siblings, I don't care what it is. It's a 460, it's identical to us, except that the train cars it's pulling are different colors. I'm gonna start doing that as I replace trains, is making them look pretty. Because right now they're all kind of solid colors, because I was uh, a little lazy at the beginning. Uh, we gotta wait for this passenger number to go through, I suppose. That's the West Haven main line. Go, 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 go. Let us through, come on. You're holding up traffic. I think he has to be in the station for us to be allowed to go. Oh, nope, there's one coming out, okay. Then we can go, once he's through that block. Yay, I was right, almost, sort of. So now we've incredibly busified this line. Which is good, because the more trains there are, objectively, the better. 
We haven't had too many, like, clogs, like, too many, like, problems, because I've, like, played this game for a long time, and I kind of know, like, what to avoid. Like, these, like, kind of queuing areas with, like, all the switches and the spaghetti, that's, like, fine, but, like, if you have that on your main line, you're gonna have some problems. Alright, we got an East Haven train, because we just put that line in, extended it finally to its final station. And we made it, Springwell. We are here. Let's uh, let's hop off, and we'll see what the situation is over in Hamden. Now that we have, yeah, people want to go to Springfield. New Road, Pax, Maine. None of them have actually made it to. I I think this no. This one's gonna go straight through. Yeah. Okay, what should we build? Should we build anything? Uh, oh, yeah, we haven't even connected con mats, and we need to get con mats somehow up to Mountain Circle. And then, again, to South Haven, Canyon Valley, Purgatory Flats, and all that business. Well, I think what we'll do is... Okay, so this will go to Springfield. This will go to... And it will go to Mountain Circle. Are there any over here... Wide planes, that's a bit of a stretch because we have one over there, but we're gonna need. No, yeah, wide plane wide planes we definitely should do because that's one town in Scornford, which will be this. Oh my, we need Oh shoot, okay. Conmats it is. We'll do this and um, I think by the time we're done it will be what time? It will be about six. 30, and that's when I have to go because I need to eat my beans and go to uh, watch Attack on Titan with one of my friends. So we're gonna, we're gonna do that. So, okay, how many stone do we have? We have one stone. We have two stone. We have... Is that it? Is that really it? No, can't be. What? I thought there was like a whole network of stone going down here. Well, we can't put it here because there's this is Deep Castle, and Deep Castle's already this, so we can't add more. Um, I see, but we can connect. Oh my god, what have I done? Well, you know what we can do? We can improvise, as musicians are wont to do. Put you flat on the ground there. We're gonna do something very interesting, which is we are going to make a stone production complex. Ooh, I hear you saying, what does that mean? Uh, we're gonna put a bunch of shit all around, and then we're gonna connect it all in the middle. So, we need five tracks. 480 meters, please. I'm gonna put you uh, there. Oh, that's horrible. Why'd you do that? Okay. Then we're gonna do this, and we're gonna do 100, no, 240 meters with one track, if you would. This isn't the most efficient way to do it, but efficiency is my, uh, not What's the opposite of a maiden name? Uh, um, not my maiden name. Yes. Okay, so then we're gonna do one here. Then yoink. No bridges. No bridges allowed. This is a industrial zone. Let me come up with like so. Alright, can you connect? No, don't don't even bother. Don't even do it. Okay, so this one's gonna be double tracked. Tunnels are allowed because tunnels are cool. Then we're gonna come down here. We're just gonna have a bunch of like shunters just moving the stone up the hill uh, into this big station, and then we're gonna have one big train that carts it all to the Conmats factory, along with the other two stone quarries.
this. Then cross her over. And you. God, I really hate that, that it doesn't. Okay, so that's a little single track. It's fine. Where's the other one? And the center track will be the out track because everyone loves to go out now and again. What the hell is going on here? That's bad. That's bad, don't do that. Can you connect? Please, please do it. Please, okay, yes. Okay, so then this one is also going to be double tracked. It's got a bit of a hike. I mean, honestly, it kind of doesn't, but, um... Yeah, you know what, we'll just put one train on it. We could really put one train on all of them except the one on the hill. Why am I signaling this? It's going to be one train. Okay, there we go. Buildings. Please provide me with your finest train depot. And that would be this one. Just heard someone shrieking in the other room. Gotta love your neighbors. You have to, because I don't. They don't love me either. experimenting with more dry senses of humor, but, uh, you know what they say. All's well that means well. Oh, autosave, come on. Don't. Get out of the way. Alright. Come on, autosave, you're really making me think about my progress. Aha. And we do one of those. These, and then we can do one of these. No. Yucky. How about that? That works. I like that. That makes me happy. And that, now we can connect everywhere. Except over here, though, because how's this? Well, it's not as bad as I thought it could have been. That's that's an example of something that you don't want is lumpy track, because lumpy track means derailment. there. Boom. And good. Yeah. And we'll connect the other end when we, when we do the other end. Nice. Okay. Thank you for those who uh, remain to tune in. It's very appreciated. Oh, can we use little babies? Can use little babies, but they're really little babies, holy crap. Uh, how about you? Oh, they're awful, Jesus. For a shunting operation, well that's what we want, I suppose. How about... You can carry 12, you can carry 12, 20 tons, 10 tons, 15 tons. These are the heaviest for some reason. Okay, middle of the road it is. Uh, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mediocre, really? Hi, not enough power. I knew it. Okay, so let's put on another little baby. How does that do? 30 kilometers, perfect. 
Let's buy one of you. Blue. Nice. And, uh, okay, so these are little O four O's. So we need four, probably have like all, f probably have like four, wow, there's multiple four fours and four fives. So we're gonna have a four 10. Okay, so this is gonna be, oh God, which depot did I put it in? This one, right? No, oh Jesus. Middle one? Oh god, I lost the train. There it is. Okay. Nice. Okay, you are what's in number 411 412. Please go on here to here. Unable to find power. We'll fix that in a second. Let's save road stone shunt one. Now, why can't you? Because of this. Now you can. Let's pause it so we can see them all come out at once. Because that's what we want to see. Okay, we won't put the, the super little babies on that one. We'll put the bigger babies on, on this one. So have these be three, and then we'll do some green, I guess. And then we'll do some that. 20, do two, we'll have these force reverse. Where were we at before? Uh, West Haven Railroad number 62, wait, uh, 6206. West Haven Railroad number 6207. You guys go from here to here. Railroad Stone Shunt 2. Alright. Number 3. Little baby. Double headed. Then. Oh, wait. We could actually put these on there, but they're terrible. Yeah. No. None of that. We're gonna do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. What was it? 120. And then we'll put, uh. on the back. Cool. And you are what's a rare number 412 413 414. I believe these are the only standard gauge 040s that we actually have right now. So exciting bananas. And you can't. Why? Because Oh, I see. Boopy. Yikes. That's actually a problem. Remember how I said everywhere could get anywhere? Or every whatever I said? Uh, I was wrong. And there. Right. Can we please? Oh, mama. Okay, no, we can't do that. Let's get rid of you. What is going on right now? You come in, oh Jesus, this track layout is like, gonna be spaghettified. There we go. And we'll delete the nonsense once we're, uh, I don't remember if we made a trade from here. And we need, oh baby. Blue, 120. And then, baby backwards and go. Let's see number 415, 416, and new line. We're gonna go here, to here. Hooray. Now we're just missing one. Right? Chunk one. Okay, no we're not. Okay, line four is What's in the stone? Shunt three. 
And line five is Plessian Road, Stone, Shumpor. And with that, you can watch our creations run amok. I actually haven't gotten a good look at these up close, but wow, these things are really tiny. I thought this engine was small, but goddamn. Sometimes you just need an 040 to, you know, just move some simple stuff around. Rail cars bigger than the engine. Wow. Usually it's the opposite. But yeah. They're off to do their business, and now we need to connect this guy to big construction over there. And we're gonna use this middle track and have him come up and over. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay. Let it come down. I guess we don't really have too much of a choice in the matter how we build this bridge, so we'll just make it look good, at the very least. What's with all the bridges? Don't do the don't do the too many bridges thing. Just enough bridges. There we go, nice and flat for maximum speeds. Oh no, please. Yes. Yes. Bridge under bridge. That's that's what we like to see. Now we'll just continue this bridge down to the water line. The water level, I should say, where we connect it up to this guy. This dead end number right here. And we're just gonna branch her off like so, cross over the water, what is going on? Can't cross the water? Can't cross the water! Okay, so we have three stone coming in, and one stone going out. So that means we need four tracks, and we're gonna use the big, big ol' station for that. we will connect to the business by a road with no tram tracks. And you come across, connect up here, and here we will double track. Wow, I really don't like the arch in that bridge. If you're gonna put an arch in it, use stone. Oh god, no, 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 no. Bad, 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 bad. Bad, bad, sad, sad, bad. How's that? That's better. Also, if you hear some, like, background buzzing, that is my AC. It is very hot, and I... Uh, I'm not gonna just shut it off because it's too fucking hot. I'll connect you up here, right? And then it'll look like a little, uh, little turn off. Well, that's not what they call it, but. Double track the nonsense. And 
Boom, we have our stone delivery line. And we will have four, two trains running. Oh, connect all the, oh Jesus. It's going to make a lot of money because the lines in this are determinate on distance and not haulage. Well, they're slightly determined by haulage, but most of it's distance. Okay, I guess we just made a dollar by putting a signal down, because that makes sense. Now... We make the overzealous uh, switches on... Uh, this guy, but this is less important because we only need one track out. We gotta make it look slightly realistic, right? Okay, let's make our new trains. Okay, so we need something more powerful for this, that is for sure. Uh, one of the most powerful engines we have right now is this uh, Renfei guy, but we also have the 10-wheeler. Um, and I think we should put the 10-wheeler on as much as possible because this is mostly an American playthrough, and you'll see that later. And 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and it's 132, right? Yeah. Let's do 3, because who knows what's going to happen. 46. We are at 46.44. Wow, that's pretty good. Let's say we're at number 46.44. Let's say we're at number 46.45. And 46.46. Oh, well, no. New line, please. You are going from here to here. West Haven Railroad, Stone, do you live? Let's put them on high maintenance, because all our trains seem to be on high maintenance. Okay, there are still trains that are waiting in the thing, so we gotta figure out what's going on here. Oh, I see. These things have a bit of a gallop to them, I gotta say. Kind of impressed with the little babies. Okay, that's the first time we've had this happen in a long time. You were... What's the problem? What? What? No, no, no. There we go. Yeah, first time we've had a problem like that in forever. Now, here's the kicker. Stone everywhere coming in here to be turned into con mats, which we will now. Okay, anything up here that needs it? No, it's just Springfield. So, the question is, do we truck it or do we train it? I wanna say we train it for now, but it could get dicey. Um, so, we'll experiment. We haven't been having good luck with trucks, actually, so let's, let's use the, uh, good old iron horse who ran the iron horse 
is a question many ask throughout their lives, but mostly Brian Wilson. This is just a short little shuttle that now has lumpy track because I didn't do it right. Flat. Please. Not even close enough for jazz. Come on. How about that? It's better. How's this? I think it's all right. Okay. Springfield. Master Connecticut. Who knows and who cares? I was in Springfield. Okay, one. One track, I mean. And then we'll have you come right into the industrial sector. Zoom in. Oof, tough angle. Oh god, right into a tunnel. Jinky Scoob, that's a roughman. You know what, we could have even done narrow gauge for this, as it's such a short little short little run. I kinda want to now. Ugh. Because get one of these going. No, but they can't like cross over very well, so we'll just use um, use a bower. No, let's use a fairly. It's a nice and short route. 120. So these are the 6600s, 6612, I don't think I see anything more, so 6613. What's we'll Romero, Con Metz, Springfield. But we do need to do this. Signal. Ah, no. Signal. What is this track? I don't even know. This appears to. Oh, okay, hang on. There's nothing even on this, so. Nope, wrong. There we are. Let's take a quick little joyride on a new Fairly type, an 0660, because there's no wheels in front, six drivers connected by the linkage, uh, another pair of six drivers connected by the linkage, and no wheels in back. When trucks get faster, this is definitely going to get replaced with a truck route. Nice. Quick little, quick little skirt down the path. And our first uh, stone train has arrived. Um, I had two hours, but I want to go to 6.30 because I said I would. Uh, so in five minutes, can I connect? Uh, where was it? Oh, jeez. Can I connect one of these all the way over here? 
My gut instinct says no, but I'm gonna give it a shot anyway. This will be the last thing we do today. It's good to be back into streaming. Um, I know uh, if you're interested in what I do, uh, Andy and Leon plays are gonna be streaming um, later today. Um, and I think it's 7.30 they're going to be doing something. Uh, they do all sorts of different different games. Um, lots of fun, fun stuff. Um, so if you uh, want to see more, uh, be sure to give them a follow because we all kind of, we do a lot of like co-streaming. So um, if you want to see more of me uh, and my sense of humor when I'm not hungry and tired from traveling all day, then uh, you can check me out on their channel and on Delra Seven's channel. I'm often uh, a guest on his as well. Well, wow, we did it. Ooh, signals on the hill, that's bad. Let's put another guy. Here. Oh, what now? Give me a second. What's the problem? What's in room 46? 46 is waiting for this, but... No, but this is very clearly not the uh, path, my friend. Oh, there's a broken track. That's why. Oh, this is not what I wanted do it right now, but I have to, so. There it is. All done. Okay. Uh, now, where were we? Stone. And it's blue, yay. To stone, or to combats. What's in railroad? Stone. Ship one. Well, it's not a ship, but... Shipping, I should say. This needs the mountain climbers, so we're going to get these guys, and we're going to put a bunch of wagons on, because there's going to be only, like, two of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, let's do 144. How can you do? Yeah, you'll do fine. Oh, we got the new caboose, nice. Okay, I think we are at, uh, what's the number? 62, oh... Nine? Question mark? Whatever. We skip one, we'll just add it in later. West End Railroad number 6210. And... Boom. I don't know if I made these guys high maintenance yet, but we will. I also realize there is going there's going to be a lot of work done on here, but oh, oh we can't ride on this one. I forgot. Oh, that kind of so, uh, botched my plans a little bit, but we can't ride on this one. So, uh, thank you everybody for uh, tuning in. This was uh, a good uh, return episode. Me getting back into the the old swing of things, the old um, uh, good uh, good time, the old fun. Um, and, uh, as our train rolls off into the, uh, the wilderness back to its, uh, uh, pickup zone, uh, I'm gonna say, uh, this was a load of fun, and, uh, I'm glad to be back, and, uh, I'm gonna go eat some beans, because I am a starving, hungry boy, so, uh, yeah, uh, Andy and Leon are on at 7.30, um, their channel is Andy and Leon Plays, um, and, uh, yeah, uh, Enjoy the rest of your evenings. This has been CD Trumpet 5 signing off.